Buttery. So today I'm coming back with our overpriced babes. You mean me? And I have four wigs and two accessories and one hat to talk about today. I also have a little of alcohol to make it more interesting and some snacks because I'm a little hungry. Let's begin. <laughs> And also a fan. <laughs> Where do I begin? If you guys want this shirt, not to promote or anything during a sponsored video, but like black owned business, adornedbychi.com. Just that. First, let's jump into these little accessories. I love them. I saw these little dangly bows and I was like, these are going to be perfect for Christmas. They actually give me that super kawaii vibe with the charms on it. We've got a heart, we've got a gem, I don't know what you want to call this, um, cubic zirconia. More like reflective plasticia in a geometric shape yeah. And then we have a fake pearl, and then we have a star. And I have no doubt that this is a sensitive accessory. This is one of those two prong clips, but I find that these kinds of clips often slip. So these are $16.99. I really wish they would just round up, babe. Like $17, just give us a flat number. What's the, the 99s? It's 99 throughout the entirety of the site. It's kind of crazy. Um, so these are $16.99, and if you get one, it's just $14.99. Not much of a saving. You be me. You be me. Come on. Come on now. The price should be cut literally in half. You only get one. $8.50 at, at the most. Girl, y'all tripping. But these are cute. Next, y'all are gonna gag. It is these Chinese style hair tassels. Like, ooh, this one still got a little bit of hair in it. <laughs> oh. Gorgeous, beautiful, immaculate, um, distracting at times. Like, this is such an easy way to really dress up a look. I don't know where I'm going, but wherever I'm going with these babes, oh, you bet somebody gonna think I'm royal there and treat me as I deserve to be treated. I really like these. However, these are $20. <laughs> and you can't just buy one, they come together. I do have to say one of the little tassel things on this already fell off. I don't know how, because I didn't even really get it out of the bag or do anything. My guess is one of the little ringlets that is securing the tassel wasn't closed enough all the way. So altogether, there's nine tassels on each of these little thingies. So you can't really tell if one falls off, but if two fall off, you might be in a little bit of a predicament. 
The other accessories are these really cute cherry earrings. These are super cute. Look at how you have to put them in. So at first I thought like, oh my God, I'm gonna have to stick this big thick piece, this metal bar into my little tiny ear hole. It's never gonna fit, it's too big. And then I did this. Oh, so you have to pull it out from the hole and then put it in through your ear hole. And then take the cherry bottom and then find the hole on the bottom and stick this pole through the hole. And boom, you have your cherry earring. And it's pretty secure, like I don't feel it slipping. I think there's some kind of ear suction technology. <laughs> I don't know. So far I haven't had any problems with it. I've actually worn these earrings out and none of them have dropped and fallen. But I know for a fact, like if I was doing some kind of, I don't know, hair flipping, like some really major hair whipping, this probably would not stand the test of gravity like that. So these are more of like a demure kind of earring when you know you're not gonna be doing extreme physical exercise or going out that night at a club. You know, you don't wanna wear these there. These are more daytime. These earrings, oh my God, these earrings are $29.99. Oh, that's crazy. Another earring I got from there is mm, this. I'm sure you guys peeped that at the very beginning of this video. Peep my bling, peep my chain. So this is $20, actually not bad. Um, I mean, still expensive for the material that they're using, but not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I really like it. It's really comfortable. Of course the cuff might get a little uncomfortable because of the weight of the actual chain and like depending on how tight you put it on your actual cartilage. A little touch and go there, but right now I'm feeling really good about it and it doesn't hurt at all. Yeah, just in case you didn't see it enough. There she is, the crosses, the crosses. For my last accessory, we have this gorgeous hat. I don't know what you wanna call this hat, a baker's hat, a beret. It's labeled as embroidered plaid beret here on their website. Y'all are not gonna guess how much this is. So this is a little tight. This is not stretchy cloth, so if you have a big head or hair, a lot of hair, this might be a little bit of a finagle situation because you will have to like really pull. Or worse comes to worse, you can clip it on, pin it on, um, if it's really that serious for you. But I actually like it. It does look kind of like a baker's hat. It's so poofy. <laughs> it doesn't even fit all the way on, especially because I got my little clips on right now. Normally you would just see like one safety pin or like two two rings in like one of these kinds of berets, but this is like almost overkill <laughs> with safety pins. Not overkill per se, but just extra. I love something a little bit extra. So four safety pins it is. Does this one actually have four safety pins? Okay, we got the button, the two, and then we got the one, big ass one, and then we got the two. Another good fact is that you can actually take these safety pins out and use them for like stuff. However, this is $26.99. You know what time it is, scales? It's time for the wig scales. <laughs> it's time for the wig scales. So first wig we're gonna go into, girls, is we're going to go into the boy wig. This actually reminds me of Sailor Uranus. I was expecting to be really disappointed by this. I was like, wait, I kind of like this one the most. It's just giving me non-binary realness. It's the perfect length, and I love that there's these little stringy bangs right here. In the front, you do have this weird pinched hairline. I mean, it's not as noticeable when, no, it's noticeable. <laughs> no, it's not lace, so there's no hairline, no lace front to be even talk about, and it is very much a wig. So this is called Harajuku Handsome Wig on the Uvimi website. There are two colors. You can get this in yellow, which is the color I got. Yellow. This is more like a dirty blonde. And this wig is $36.99. This, you see how short this wig is? And the hairline. 
Like you can even see how pinched the hairline is in the very first photo. There is this weird T. So you get the fleshy plastic part and then there's like this weird thing where they take the plastic and they flip it over the front of the hairline. It just don't look right. But that's my biggest complaint about this wig as well as the price. This is not a $37 wig. You already know I've reviewed other Yumi stuff, so you already know how I feel about the pricing and like the actual quality of their, not only their clothing, but their wigs as well. So this next girl said to me, as we go on, we remember all the times we had together. It's your girl, Vitamin C. This is it. Like, this is a vibe. Like, you can't sing really, but this is it. If y'all don't know who Vitamin C is, she came out with a song called Graduation. As we go on, we remember all the time we had together. As well as vacation where I wanna be, party on the beach where the fun is free. We don't need a holiday to stop and celebrate. Cause I need a break, I need a vacation. Love the blunt cut on this wig and the gradient is immaculate. Girl, the real hair Chinese website girls could never. The name of this hair is Milk Gold Gradient Dirty Orange Wig. What do you mean, what? Anyway, this is $36.99. I told y'all everything is doop doop 99 on this site. And that's another problem I have with you, Vimi. They just be blatantly using pictures of people that are not wearing the wigs at all. Like this girl fully has, this, this is her natural human hair. Clearly, it is her natural human hair. And then I click on the actual picture of the wig and it looks completely different. She don't even have the same style. The only thing that she has familiar is the bang. So I don't know why they're using her as a reference on this. Um, website. I don't know if y'all want to pay $37 for a plastic wig like this, but I heard there's cheaper avenues. Don't tell you, be me. She is definitely a fave. I'm definitely going to be wearing her sometime with like a very gorgeous orange or yellow look. I know some of y'all are thinking, oh, it looks more like the fifth element. Multi-pass, multi-pass. Girl, we did that. Did that, done that. Fifth element had locks. We're, yeah, no. That's vitamin C. This is vitamin C. Our next wig is this wig that I'm wearing actually right now. Okay, okay, are you feeling it? Are you feeling it? I'm feeling it. That's why I'm wearing it, you know. <laughs> I like this wig out of all the wigs. This is probably my favorite. Just for the simple fact that it covers my forehead. The plastic fleshy hairline can be colored and isn't like super out there or noticeable. And I don't really have to worry about like my actual hair or my wig cap showing through. The color is black pink on the website, but this is more like a muted gray pink. Like, girl, this is barely pink. And the other color that you can choose, ooh, is brown pink. And the brown pink looks, the brown that they're saying is really, really, really light. It's more like, um, um guess how much this wig is? $38.99. Girl, you heard that right. It is gosh darn near $40 for this hair. That's all I have to say about that. I do like this wig though. The last one, I'm really not even gonna take out of the bag because I'm really tired, is this. This is their Hatsune Miku type beat <laughs> wig. They call this a green long wig. Like, is this green to y'all? But they do say it is Hatsune Miku cosplay mint, uh, green wig, mint green, on their website. Guess how much it is? $49.99. $49.99 for this wig because it is a very, very long wig. You know Hatsune Miku has inches, inches, all the way down past the booty crack, past the thigh, like inches. They really gave us inches with this wig and it came to me pre-tied with little baby hairs in the back, which I really liked and that was a really nice touch and two hair clips. I don't know what you call those bear claw clips. Is that what they're called, bear claw clips? Basically, I think those are used to like prop up the hair and make it look more poofy or whatever because normally what they'll do is you'll have like a short wig and then someone will give you like a, a ponytail with a bear claw clip in it and so that way you can just bear claw the clip into the short wig and then, you know, do whatever you need to do after that. But no, this is just all one wig. And then the accessory that comes with it is the hair bow. You don't have to pay any extra cost for that. I mean, I guess you're paying an extra cost because this price is extra, but this just comes 
with the bow, but the clip that's actually on the bow kind of makes it hard for it to stand up. And I'm still trying to figure out like how to style that because the way that the clip sits on the bow makes it so that way the bow kind of sits flat. So instead of standing upright, you know, and having the little bow ears be up, it's flat. It keeps either flying back. And as expected from long uh, synthetic wigs, it gets tangled really easily, like really easily. I really feel like the shelf life of this wig is not gonna be long. <laughs> I'm really not gonna wear this wig that much. Like it's definitely, this is a special occasion wig. That's it for today's video. Thank you so much to Yuvini for sending me these special gifts. I really, really love this hair and I love my accessories. So if you guys want any of these items, everything will be listed down below. And until next time, it's been your girl. Me, my name is Jane. And I hope to see you guys all later. Bye!